it's Breland here. I am gonna be doing something a little different, like always, and that is testing out really strange Amazon products. So let me show you some of the things that I got. These, and you know what these are for? <laughs> They're hands for your fingers. I honestly have no idea why. <laughs> They're so crazy. So I have hands for my fingers, and I got these for, I think I paid like $7 for these, and you just wear them. I guess you wear them to like freak people out. How many fingers am I holding up? <laughs> Wait, I'll give you a hand. <laughs> wow, that was cheesy. That, was, that wasn't even funny, it was so stupid. <laughs> Alright, so the next thing that I found, this is so funny. Just, this is just as funny as those crazy hands. And that is this chicken! Look at her. Look at her. <gasps> what is that? Ew! <laughs> you squeeze her and the egg pops out of her panonka. Like, what the heck? That is vile. If you're a vegan, this will just confirm the fact that that's a good idea to be a vegan. So the next thing that I got, this one's actually really fun. This is something you would set on your desk. And this is one of those fun magnetic things. So what you're supposed to do is you have these butterflies here. And you're supposed to be able to like build them up like this. Let me show you. You're supposed to be able to build them up really high. And you can just position them like that. So another thing I came across on Amazon was this super cute bear sandwich cutter. I know that there's another one on Amazon that's like just the bear head, but this one here you're supposed to be able to make a sandwich and then press this into the sandwich and you can also use this to create like the little bear's face. So that way you can have like fun sandwiches for your kids, for yourself, whatever you want. So I'm gonna insert a clip from a really awesome tutorial and I'm also going to link their video in the description below of how you actually cut into the sandwich and what one of these actually looks like. You guys know that I love really weird hair products and that is this. I know, this just looks like an ordinary hairbrush, right? Look at the bristles. So you squeeze the back pull it in and look the bristles are completely gone and you know why this is a self cleaning hairbrush it's a hairbrush that will like spit out all the hair in the bristles so you just squeeze these little buttons on the back and then you have to manually push or pull to make the bristles go in and out now i haven't actually tried it i'm going to try it now and see if i can get some hair in it my hair is super staticky right now. So you may be able to see like this little bit of hair like right here. And pull. And now you can just wipe the hair away. And now it's completely clean. So the next two things, oh wait that's four things. <laughs> two things that I found on Amazon that I really just thought they were so creepy and weird. I really wanted to include them in this video. So hang on just a second. Are you ready for this? Ta-da! <laughs> How creepy is this? So this mask here, it's got like double eyes. It kind of reminds me of the Promise Fawn makeup that she did that one time. And it just looks really crazy, especially with the tongue sticking out and everything. And I was able to scare my mom and David with this mask. Oh, I also scared my friend Slava on FaceTime. And they all had the same reaction. They were like, oh my gosh, what is that? Okay, so now I have one more mask. Ta-da! It's an upside down head. How crazy is this? It's creepy. It's just something that just makes someone do a double take. And that's the reason why I really loved it and I wanted to include it in this video. It's just so creepy and weird. Ah, help me! Okay, I'll stop. Let's move on. <sighs> My hair. <laughs> So last but definitely not least, I am going to be showing you and testing out this. <laughs> 
Okay, so yes, it is what you think it is. It's a water bottle that holds an electronic device while there's water in it. So yes, it is what you think it is. It's a water bottle that holds your phone. So this is what it looks like. This is it from the side. Um, I'm just gonna take this off. And this is where your phone goes. This is the fake phone. So it has this compartment right here where your phone goes. So I'm going to put my phone in it. Hopefully my phone fits. I'm not really sure if my phone is going to fit because it's the plus. And it's not going to fit. So I'm just going to put the paper one in there. I mean this is going to test it out just to make sure that no water is going to get to this. I mean it is paper after all. So you just want to screw the bottom on really tight. Then you just want to take some water, fill it up. And there you go, look at there. It's filled with water and the foam part is completely dry. Look at that. Oh my gosh, you can see my reflection. <laughs> so I poured some of the water out so you can see the water moving around in there. And I'm gonna go ahead and put the lid back on. So you can actually take the bottom off while there's water in it. And check that out. It's completely dry. It's actually cold because my water is cold. So I'll be sure to link all of these crazy products in the description below as well as the videos that I used. I made sure to include credit in the description below. Thanks to everyone for those videos. Let me know in the comments if you want to see another video like this. I had a lot of fun testing everything out. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. And I thank you so much for watching and have a glitterful day. Love you. Bye.